Born to Suffer. This is a leaflet that's currently being distributed by the RSPCA with regard to certain breeds and one in particular is close to our hearts, it's the Bulldog. And on this leaflet it's stating that 80% of uh, Bulldogs are, are born by caesarean section and citing the reason being the size of the puppy's head. Well, this is absolute nonsense. And here, I've just got some newly born puppies. They're a day or so old. I'm going to have a little look at the head girth. Which we're saying is just under the six inches. Yep, just. These puppies are about a day or two old. And the body? Seven. Seven inches. So there you have the head being somewhat smaller. That's one puppy. Than the body. So I, I don't know where they say the head's too large, but here we go. We'll get another one out. And we've got a head diameter there. Is that just over six or under six? Just under. Just under six inches in diameter. And then we'll go around puppy's chest. Six. Can't see that. About six and three quarter. About six and three quarter. So there again on this puppy we also have a larger. You know, see we've got a little assortment of puppies in here, we're not just pulling the same puppy out all the time. About six and a quarter. Just over the six inches on the diameter of the head. And around puppy's girth, around the rib cage. Seven and a half. Where, where, where on earth are they they're coming out with this theory then that the head is so massive on a puppy that it can't come out because of this and the head's clearly seen to be smaller than the girth, the body girth. Who on earth writes this nonsense and, and people are donating to have this sort of stuff published? Five and a quarter. Five and a quarter around the head. <laughs> and probably little wriggler. Let's have a look just, um, just below six. Just below six. So there again. What's that, three or four puppies you've had there? And each one of them's got a bigger body girth than it has a head size. Six. Six inches. They're all a sort of a steady round the six inch diameter. Here again, can I six and that? three quarter. There we go, on the body side. So, you've got seven puppies in there, Maria. Yep. All shapes and sizes. All coming out roughly with the same sort of head size and the same sort of girth size. Six. Six and three quarter. So, once again, so and there's 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 one other little thing that I'd just like to note along this these puppies uh, we're showing you yeah were actually self whelped they weren't born by C-section and you may possibly find that because of nonsense that is being published like this and because of certain vets that will tell people that a bulldog can't give birth naturally and and. I'd, I'd hate to think that they were doing that just to fleece their own pockets. Novices in the breed are never going to try to self whelp a bitch because they're being told by people who believe are knowledgeable that the bulldog can't give birth. Well, if you're going to cite one of the reasons, please don't say it's the size of the head because it isn't the size of the head and, and, and it's clear to see there.